Okay, we're at uh, Nazca in Peru, and this is an ancient Nazca period irrigation system. It's called Pukio, but that actually refers to the circular holes in the background here, and an example of one behind. But this aqueduct system was very extensive between about 100 BC and 600 AD, with the termination of the Nazca, um, not empire, but Nazca civilization. And so you can see the water that's still running through it. That water comes from the Andes, which is a long way back to the east. But you can see it's been refurbished and it's functioning. The water is cold still because of the coolness. And most of the system, though, is uh, it's a series of underground streams and rivers that run from the Andes area towards the Pacific Ocean. And so the Nazca and earlier Paracas people, people were clever enough to be able to find out where this underground system was. And that's also why some of the Nazca lines exist. They're actually a map, or some of them are a map of the underground water system because there is no surface water in this area. Without this underground system, this would be complete desert, but it's actually one of the most productive areas of agriculture in all of Peru.